Next, we will look at the Clemson Network Registration. This is something that must be done before you can use the network at Clemson. Open a browser window. We recommend that you use Internet Explorer for this step. If this is the first time your computer has been used on the Internet at Clemson, you will see the network registration screen. If you've already completed this and it goes to another web page, just close your browser. If you see the Go button in the middle of the screen, click on it. Type in your username and your password and click Login. You may need to scroll down to see the bottom of the screen. In the description field, put in your username, follow it by a dash and some kind of description of your laptop. If you've got a Dell E6400, you might want to put that. You should note that this is not a place to put any notes to yourself since this field is used by CCIT to determine what computer is connected to the network. The policy on information resources is on this page. You should read all of this at some point. It is repeated on the CCIT webpage. It says that you will use the Clemson network within the boundaries set by CCIT. When you've finished reading through this, go ahead and click on the Accept button and close your browser. It will ask you to reboot your computer, but you do not need to do that right now. You may be asked to repeat this for other connections and in future years. To see your own registrations, you can visit netreg.clemson.edu.